Hey, Dave. Um, how's Corey Seager feeling after his live BP yesterday? Is it still a possibility that we could see him activated tomorrow? Uh, he feels good, Kirsten. Um, not sure um, when the activation. Um, I, I think more right now I'm leaving it in the uh, training staff's hands. Um, he wants to be active. Um, but again, we're just kind of making sure he feels so. I'm still reluctant to say what what day uh, it will it'll be. Um, hopefully, it, it's short, it's sooner than later, but I just don't know exactly what day. And what um, is there anything in specific that you're looking to hear from the training staff to kind of give you the go ahead? I, I just want the green light on um, the build up, the hand, the soft tissue, um, feeling like. Um, when he gets out there, he can, we can run him out there for six, seven days in a row. Um, the, the hitting guys telling me mechanically he's sound Corey, give me the green light, all that stuff. So there's a lot of uh, moving parts, but, uh, ultimately we're just not quite there yet. And with Josiah Gray, you mentioned yesterday that he'll take the bulk of the innings today. I think he's built up, as you said, to about 80 pitches. What is the plan for him today? He's going to get in the game. Uh, he's going to make his major league debut. Um, I, I don't know if it, I don't know what inning, um, but um, like I said, he's going to pitch the bulk of the game and, and we'll figure out uh, what, uh, what run he has. I know he's excited. I'm sure his family's excited. So uh, uh, Nunez is going to start the game and we'll see how long he can go. And then, uh, you know, whether it's somebody else before Josiah or Josiah following, uh, I'm not, not quite sure yet. Thanks, Dave. Yep. Next question is Juan Taribio. Good. Hey, Dave. How's Mookie feeling? Um, he, he's uh, he's frustrated. Uh, it, it's something that, like we've talked about, he, he's been battling with this uh, hit pointer uh, all year, and uh, the the running in Colorado sort of got to him and kind of. Uh, ticked it off and irritated it. So uh, it's inflamed and um, not in there uh, tonight. We'll see if he's available to pinch it. I think he will be, um, but he wants to be in there. Mookie understands, you know, the value of him being in the lineup, uh, the series, obviously the importance of the series. So, uh, but when you go out, can't go out there and be yourself and, and run balls down in the outfield, scoring a base hit from second base, um, you know, we, we don't want it to be more more harm than good. So uh, to stay away from him, to not have him in there, probably the best thing right now, we'll see where he's at tomorrow. And you you mentioned, he mentioned that something that he's dealt with all season, but is this maybe the, maybe the worst that it's been uh, now that he's missing a couple games? Yeah, yeah, it is, it is. Um, you know, it, it's been there, uh, we've managed it, but I think sometimes it just kind of something triggers and it just uh, is inflamed. And so I don't know what it was in particular, but it's kind of where we're at right now and we're just trying to manage it. Uh, like I said, Mookie wants to be in there uh, for his teammates, um, just can't do it right now. So hopefully each day that passes, um, we can get him in a better spot. And with Darren Nunez, what have you guys liked um, in, in a couple of weeks that he's been up here? I, I like the head. I, I like um, – he just seems uh, unflappable. Uh, I like the throw. He fills the strike zone up. And um, just fun getting to know him. Um, so it's, it's an opportunity that he's worked really hard for. And uh, I know he's very grateful. Thanks, Dave. Next question is from Fabian Ardaya. Go ahead. Hey Dave, uh, I mean obviously this isn't the first time you're meeting Josiah, but like, what? How have you gotten to know him in the last few years? What sort of stands out to you about him, and what was that conversation like when he came in yesterday? Uh, joy, um, excitement. Uh, he he knows. I mean, obviously, I have a really good relation with Josiah. He knows our staff. He knows the players. Um, so I, I know that uh, I'm excited for him personally. Uh, our player development guys. Have poured a, poured really uh, poured into him, and and he's grown. You can tell he's raised well. I'm sure his family will be in attendance. So it's just a, it's just a great story, and uh, I expect him to go out there and pitch well. And what I mean, obviously, coming into a Dodgers Giants game for your debut uh, is is quite the stage just to jump into. I mean, how have you sort of seen him handle bigger moments in the past in his career, and how do you expect him to sort of handle uh, tonight? 
Um, he's a really good competitor. I, I think that like any young player, there's going to be adrenaline, emotions, and whether it's in uh, spring training or in the freeway series, which we've seen him and he gets amped up, I expect there to be emotions. So it's going to be coming in hot, but uh, he's still got to be able to kind of rein it in and know that the, the natural adrenaline is going to kick in. So um, it, it's still part of it. It's still part of a debut for anyone. Thanks, Dave.